fawn on the, on the side of US, uh, Sino-US relations? 18 torpedoes on two subs are not going to change uh, Taiwan's operational capabilities. More important is the political signal that it sends that the United States is committed to the defense of a longtime democratic ally. Okay. Uh, as you mentioned, China has become more assertive around Taiwan, and the United States, uh, especially in this environment of uh, deteriorating U.S.-China relations um, is sending a strong message to China that we are committed to peace and security in the Asia-Pacific. Notice that the arms sales were announced on the day of Tsai Ing-wen's inauguration. So that was a political calculation. At the same time, U.S. Secretary of State um, Mike Pompeo sent congratulatory message to President Tsai Ing-wen, as did White House Deputy National Security Advisor Matt Pottinger in Mandarin. Speaker of the U.S. House Nancy Pelosi also sent a message. So this is uh, certainly political. Um, and, and we cannot deny that these torpe torpedoes are at least advanced um, weapons systems. Uh, Taiwan certainly would need a lot more submarines to be able to have two or three out at any one time to really um, use them as some type of a security measure. Um, but again, this is more of a political message than um, an operational um, decision. Great. Um, I agree with you, Lai. Here's the point. The political messaging comes at a time when overall tenor of Sino-U.S. relations is not looking up. Uh, also, uh, if we look at it uh, in, in, in terms of neorealism, I mean, this is a rising power which is going to create its own Monroe Doctrine in the area. I mean, the, this area, whether it's South China Sea or East China Sea, this is China's near 